all right guys so this is going to be the first of many videos in this series and this is going to be all about clippers for natural hair and mainly for those of you who would like to cut your hair in what is called a tapered cut or an undercut and there's very different styles and looks to those types of cuts but um, today I'm just really going to focus on the choice of clippers and I'm going to make it as simple as possible these are the um, clippers and trimmers that I have um, it is very important that you try to get a pair of clippers that cuts your hair and a pair of trimmers that is good to trim up or to edge your hairline up especially the nape of your hair so I would not suggest that you just get clippers and expect for it to do the cutting the lineup and everything it's good to have a small pair of trimmers as well for touch-ups and things like that but this is what I have there are many brands the most common brand is wall and I also have another one that's adjustable which is a Andis and this comes in the kits for my Andis uh, clippers, they came in this. And when I opened it, everything was kind of put in there a certain way. So they came in this Andis uh, set. And all of the guards, there's uh, it starts from zero and it ends at eight. So I have zero, one, two three four and then it skips to six and eight for these two I have what are called tapered um, guards and they're in an angle so that you can be able to have shorterness near the uh, ear and more length towards the top of your hair and then with this one I have blending like a blender guard and you always want to make sure you have oil you want to oil your clippers um, before each use there's a comb and there's two brushes one to clean and then there's one to uh, clean up the person that <laughs> you're working with but that's what my clippers are now trimmers I have a wall and that came with it all came in this pouch from a box so all of this fit in here and these have guards starting from one all the way to number four so there's one two three and four there are uh, two guards that are for tapered they're called taper guards left and right ear taper guards hope you guys can see that has a little small comb a little brush for cleaning the clippers and that's it guys now I am going to show you a further clip on how you can purchase your own where you can get them from and what it would look like but these are the clippers and trimmers that I use all you need to know before I continue with this series is that you need a pair of clippers and a pair of trimmers that have guards so that it'll make it a lot easier for you to cut your hair on your own so that's pretty much it guys um yeah let's check out the next clip so here i am in myers actually and keep in mind you can find clippers and trimmers anywhere including beauty supply stores today they have a small selection but you can find a set that has both clippers and trimmers this one has all the tools and guards that you need here is the trimmers I have and I actually got mine from Walmart Now these are the wall clippers. Although I have Andis, they are just as great. Notice these have all the guards and tools needed as well. Well, that's it guys. Although there are many brands, 
keep in mind that you need both clippers and trimmers so it's your choice to buy them together or separate they're not expensive but they are a great investment if you want to cut your hair yourself the next video will be another detailed demonstration on how and where to begin when it comes to cutting your natural hair however in the meantime you can click on the playlist to view all my natural hair cutting videos and I'll see you guys in the next video.